गायज आवर यू वेलकम टू डब्ल्यू एलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स यूट्यूब चैनल गायस टूडे वी विल अनबॉक्स डिजिटल मल्टी मीटर जूई ब्रांड एंड मॉडल नंबर जेड टी एक्स इट्स आ जूई ब्रांड मल्टी मीटर जेड टी एक्स आई रिसीव दिस मल्टी मीटर एज अ गिफ्ट फ्रॉम जूई सो लेट्स अनबॉक्स दिस वन एंड चेक वॉट वी फाउंड इन साइड दिस बॉक्स एंड वॉट द फंक्शन ऑफ दिस मल्टी so first of all we found one multimeter with pouch testing probe and this temperature sensor with probes and one user manual inside the pouch this is user manual so this four things we found inside the box one user manual temperature testing probes and this testing probes and multimeter with pouch so we will remove the multimeter wow it's a beautiful multimeter as you can see zui ztx model number and you can measure up to 1000 voltage and uh, up to 10 ampere ac dc so one by one we will check all the function of this multimeter so you can see the look here the folding stand here the battery cover two double a size batteries for this multimeter and this is the menu of this multimeter it's a digital automatic multimeter and you can see this is the current measuring probe points so we will remove this sticker it's a 4 ampere this probe for ampere this is for micro ampere this is common point and this is for Uh, voltage and uh, ohm diodes and capacitance this all selection for this one and this is the power on off button so we will power on this one meter you can see this is power on it's looking a very good big display of this multimeter as you can see in this display three lines upside center one and downside this is now selection ac dc you can change ac also it will show you hertz this is the temperature and millivolt selection this is the ohm selection diode selection and continuity selection capacitance selection this is all selection here this is you can change the manual and auto range manual range and auto range this is selection only for hertz if you want to see the hertz so you select first ac and then push this one it will show you the hertz here so let's remove the testing probe from the pouch and we will check one by one this is the testing probe and it's look like very good quality multimeter quality built on quality also good it's a abs plastic not easily broken this is zui brand ztx so let's remove the protection cover also from the testing probe so we will test one by one in this manual all instruction given i will uh, tell you the main specification of this multimeter this is the automatic and manual also it support ncv non contact voltage detection its dc voltage range 0 to 1000 voltage its ac voltage range is 0 to 750 voltage up to ac its current range ac and dc both 0 to 10 ampere you can measure 0 to 10 ampere ac and dc current its resistance range is 0 to 100 mega ohm and its capacitance range is 0 to 10 milli farad and its frequency you can measure up to 10 megahertz and its duty cycle up to 99% diode on off beep also supporting hold also button have so this is holding button and hd display display count is 9999 it mean up to four digit can count of this display and its temperature measurement range is minus 20 degree to up to 1000 degree celsius so this is the main specification of this multimeter and i told you two double a size battery 
for this multimeter so let's connect our probe on multimeter this is the positive selection and this is i will put in common first we check continuity as you can see when i shot the both leads it's showing me beep sound and zero so like this we will check one by one all things so guys for testing i on the multimeter i press the and hold the power on button multimeter will on i select the ac range it's automatic when i connect this on my ac supply you can see it's showing me 215 voltage it's a 220 voltage at 215 voltage it's showing and also it's showing me 59.96 hertz frequency its frequency is 60 hertz so it's showing me almost 60 if you want to see in big screen so you can select the hertz option so you can see 59.96 hertz frequency it's showing me and for voltage it's showing me 216 voltage it's a 220 voltage so 216 coming now voltage and also showing here true rms voltage it's a true rms voltage for dc we will select the dc option i have this battery so we will check the battery voltage as you can see battery showing me 8.466 voltage so dc voltage you can check like this for capacitance you need to select the capacitance range i select from here capacitance range it's a 25 microfarad capacitor and how much it's showing me 25 microfarad as you can see on multimeter it's showing me 25 microfarad and this is the one capacitor and it's a 2200 microfarad i will check this capacitor also on multimeter how much showing as you can see this one showing 2.10 millifarad and, and this capacitor, this capacitor is, is 33 microfarad so we will check it's showing us 33 or not so it's showing us almost 32 microfarad so like this you can check your capacitor for resistance you just need to connect one lead and other lead of resistance it's a 22 ohm resistance and multimeter also showing me 22 ohm and this resistance also we check it's a 55 kilo ohm resistance also showing me 55 kilo ohm so like this you can check your resistance for continuity and fuses you need to select the continuity or fuse range and meter showing me beep sound and also showing me zero it's mean this fuse okay like this we can check other fuse if it's also showing us beep it's mean this fuse okay and for diode a node connect with positive and cathode with negative so it's showing us the biasing voltage like this we can check the diode so its biasing voltage is 1.82 it's mean this diode okay also we can check the led on this selection see led is glowing and also meter showing us the voltage how much voltage applying meter 2.6 voltage and led also glowing so like this we can check the led also as well for transistor we can also check on the diode selection you can see from base to emitter and base to collector it's showing us the reading so it means this transistor is also okay so like this you can check all measurement through this all selections now i will also show you this temperature working of this temperature probe how it's working i will show you guys i also show you ncv function of this multimeter how to use ncv function for ncv function you need to select from here ncv section after that you need to put the device on wire you can see This is the our breaking point, so it's showing us beep. As you can see, it's a breaking point. It's showing us beep. So like this way, you can check the damage wire 
from which point damage on good section it will show you continue beep on damage section this beep you can see there is some delay in beep and in good part continue beep so like this you can use this ncv function as well of this multimeter for temperature measurement you need to connect these two probes on common uh, and after select this temperature section as you can see it's coming in the centigrade and fahrenheit both reading also this is the hot water i hot this one i will put this sensor probe inside this water so when i put this probe it's showing me how much centigrade it's a 77 78 80 degree centigrade 82 still increasing 85 86 so this water temperature is 87 degree centigrade and 189 fahrenheit so like this you can check the temperature of anything with the help of this probe you need to put this probe on this heating part or heating element and you can check the temperature of that device so like this you can check the temperature hope you like the video guys if you like kindly subscribe my youtube channel like the video share with your friends and if you like to buy this multimeter i will give you link in description you can buy through that link it's a very good brand and good quality multimeter in cheap price not it's very expensive so you can buy you can see it's giving us a premium look so it's very good instrument device with all available function inside this device so hope you like it this is the all about this multimeter thanks for watching guys take care bye